tonight in Sacramento, where county deputies are just ending a standoff with a shooting suspect in Fair Oaks at an apartment complex on Winding Way. ABC 10's Roxanne Elias has been on scene since this morning and joins us live right now. Roxanne, how did all of this end? Well, Laura, for seven or more long hours, residents here have been waiting for this to be resolved. Just a few minutes ago, they could breathe a sign of relief. This is after about 30 minutes ago, we heard what sounded like two loud flashbangs out here. Moments later, the sheriff's office letting us know that the suspect had peacefully surrendered. Now, this all started around 10 Friday morning as deputies responded to a shots fired call at the apartment complex off Winding Way. They found a bullet hole in a window, and at some point, deputies shot at the suspect, but it's unclear what led up to that. No deputies were hurt, but residents were evacuated from the area and asked to shelter in place. The sheriff's office says they reached out to the suspect by phone around noon in an attempt to get him to surrender. Now, earlier today, we talked to one of the residents here, Sandra Alva, who says the area is usually pretty quiet and is this is actually one of the first major incidents they've had. Her work, daughter's work in law enforcement, and she says she was pleased to see the quick response. The response is phenomenal, but I don't know whether it's overkill or not, but because you don't know what's going on in there. You don't know whether he's loose. You don't know whether how many other people are involved. But um, yeah, I'm glad that they are. I hope that it turns out that nobody loses their life. Deputies, many of them have left the area and roads are starting to reopen. We are waiting to hear from the sheriff's office around 645 or 7 this afternoon. We will, of course, bring you the latest once we hear from them on the specifics of what led up to this. Laura. Yeah, Roxanne, quickly, are you hearing if neighbors are able to go back home? I have not heard that. I was told that many of them decided to actually just shelter in place if they didn't want to leave. Uh, several people are still standing out here trying to just watch and see what's going on. But they have reopened and taken the tape off of this entrance here. So we did see a few residents kind of walking around the area. We just don't have official word if they're able to return at this point. Okay, understandable. Roxanne Elias, thank you for that update. Certainly a tense start to the weekend for neighbors. Glad to hear this ended peacefully. Roxanne Elias, thank you.